I made my first video movie when I was a senior in high school, and we're talking VHS tape back in 1992, because I'm old. And then in college, I got a very small grant to make my first feature-length movie on video. And then after college, I made more movies. They were all between 15 minutes and an hour long. None of them were really features. None of them had budgets. They were all the kinds of movies where you're just trying to get your friends, you're holding auditions on campus, trying to meet people, and cheerlead them on to work for free for as many days as you needed them. And after a while, that gets really old. It gets really hard. And the movies weren't that rewarding to finish anymore. So I quit for several years. And I told myself I wasn't going to make another movie unless it was awesome. And it took six years before another movie came along where it was something that excited me enough to get the movie made. Because your love of the idea, your love of the script, is the only thing that's going to sustain you through the whole production of it. So if you don't really, really love it, like you love like a significant other or a spouse, you're going to give up on it halfway through. Especially when you're not getting paid, no one else is getting paid. So found, when I discovered it, um, read it in one sitting, had to pee like halfway through and, and didn't even get up. I was so thrilled and exhilarated. I, I cannot even put into words how badly I, you can ask Jen Handy, she's the only other person who's an eyewitness account of how ecstatic I was after reading the book. And I wanted to do it so badly that I then became terrified that maybe I wouldn't be able to do it because the possibility of doing it was almost single-handedly lifting me out of this five or six year doldrums. So I wrote Todd Rigney, and he said yes. I went and met him. He was awesome. He agreed to let me have permission to make the movie with no upfront money because we had no money. And thank God he did because now I feel like I'm back in the saddle and now I'm making movies again. Whereas there was five or six years there where I didn't know if I was ever going to do it again.